Well, good Wednesday morning, everyone. I'm Maggie Fleckno. And I'm Star Harvey. And you are watching Houston Happen. So, Star, uh -huh. today is a very special day. Yes, it is one of my favorite days. It is my mama's birthday today. I love it. <laughs> Happy birthday. So do I. You know, Maggie, there honestly isn't no birthday wish big enough to celebrate this queen. Today, my mom turns 52 years old and she puts the beauty in aging for me. She's going to oh. kill me for throwing out I was going to say, well, I can't believe you said her age. <laughs> I know. She, she, you know what? Unfortunately, it's tough to put into words what she actually means to me, but I will say this. It's the joy and livelihood that she brings to everyone Aww. else around her for me. So, sitting a very happy birthday all the way to Los Angeles. I'm so happy that she, you know, is home with all yeah. my other siblings. Yeah. The least favorites. And, you know, she's surrounded by family enjoying her day, although I can't be there. So, Aww. I love you, Mom, and happy birthday. And we love our moms and it's so funny because our moms are practically birthday twins mm -hmm. so yesterday was my mom's birthday and I did a surprise say yes to the dress moment for her here we are at Neiman's we found her dress for my wedding yes. she was so surprised I got her a sweet personal shopper champagne and I just wanted this whole wedding planning I think the mm -hmm. most important thing has been sharing these moments with her yeah and I wanted, she's so selfless like your mom, and yeah. I wanted her to have her say yes to the dress moment like she had with me. Yeah. And it just, my heart is full. So both of our moms, thank you happy for birthday. raising such amazing, <laughs> amazing women. Leos, yes. we love them, and happy birthday. We yes, love you both for sure. <laughs> now we also have other top talkers mm -hmm. today, and this is Breaking from Overnight, Olympic champ, champ, I should say, and spring native Simone Biles withdrew from the individual all around competition to focus on her mental well-being. And it's been really stressful, this Olympic Games, I think, just as a whole, um, not having an audience. There are a lot of different variables going into it. It's been a long week. It's been a long Olympic process. It's been a long year. Um, so just a lot of different variables, and I think we're just a little bit too stressed out. Um, but we should be out here having fun, and sometimes that's not the case. So Jade Carey, who finished ninth in qualifying, will actually take Biles' place in the all-around. Biles will be evaluated daily before deciding if she will participate in next week's individual events. And honestly, I commend her. She gets yeah. a gold for taking care of herself, and that's something I feel it's not easy to do, and especially for women. I yeah. feel like we suck it up and we go through the yeah. motions. And she also didn't want this to affect her teammates. I also, I follow Maria Shriver, mm -hmm. absolutely love her. Yes. And she said, why don't we take this opportunity not to focus on, you know, this, her mm -hmm. dropping out, but the other women who are making history and support yeah. each other. So I think Biles, that's what she wants to do is focus on her teammates and all of the other athletes who yeah. are paving the way, the women out there. Yeah, and I agree with that. You know, I'm so happy to see these young women, you know, setting the example to take care of ourselves yes. first, you know? and whatever that may be, mental health, especially at the top of that, you know, they're setting that example to make it okay yeah. to, you know, take care of ourselves. Because there's like usually a stigma and finally mm -hmm. we're beating that stigma we of sure mental are. health and we're talking about yes. it. So yes. yes, I hope you all are winners. And speaking of the games, these newborns mm -hmm. are goo goo gooing, if you will, for the gold and melting our hearts. Star, <laughs> this will cheer you up for sure. Look at this. Oh. Nurses at a Missouri hospital hand crocheted uniforms for a miniature Olympic opening ceremony featuring the hospital's tiniest athletes. The preemies and newborns represented a multitude of Olympic sports, including swimming, boxing, basketball, and gymnastics. The families got to keep these handmade outfits. I mean, look at that. They have their tennis racket <laughs> and their little dumbbell. And uh, the hospital even made gold medals for all of the Olympians. Is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen? Oh my goodness, I am all for this. I am definitely that mom. So I love this, how cute. I know, and I love the nurses, yes. like taking care of it yeah. and the family. Sometimes it's hard. My best friend's baby was mm -hmm. um, in the NICU and they just have this, this heart of gold, yeah, yeah, literally, yeah. they yeah. get a gold medal, the and nurses they become, there. And they become family, yeah. you build these relationships and they take care of your babies and I love to see it. Me too, and <laughs> we're gonna have more of those over on our yeah. website. I could look at those pictures all day, cw39.com. All right, speaking of kids, mm -hmm. this one is a talker. Mila <laughs> Kunis and Ashton Kutcher, you know, the celebs, mm -hmm. they're married. They actually have everyone talking about their specific approach to their kiddos' back time. All right, so take a listen to this. The couple, who have a six and four-year-old, said that they don't believe in bathing their kids with soap 
every day. Kuna said she didn't have hot water as a kid, and then Kucher added, quote, now here's the thing, if you can see the dirt on them, clean them, otherwise there's no point. Now I'm not a mom star, but I could see maybe not bathing a baby every day because their skin mm -hmm. is so sensitive, and I know doctors, I was doing some research, they recommend not doing that, but these kids are six and four. My mom always was like, I mean, as soon, she hates smell kids. Mm -hmm. She was like, here's some deodorant, honey, yes. and perfume. Yes. I think I was probably four with perfume. You know, and, and I'm for that. I will stop Bryce at the door. I'm not for not bathing kids every day, especially when they reach that age. And it's boys, just, like, sweaty. Mm -hmm. I don't need that. You know, I'm going to drench you in water. I'm just going to soak you in that tub. And <laughs> this is this is a no-go. Four and six. Yeah, that's start. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Don't do that. And then at school, they're, they're those smelly kids yeah. will get made fun of. I don't know. Oh. I bathe, like, I love showering. Right. Three. I even shower before I work out. Yes, me so too. So I shower, like, three times you, a day. You have to here in Houston. With this yeah, humidity, right? you're in that tub and Girl, yeah, showering. We smell. Three, good. four, five times a day. Good. Good. We smell good. All right. Yes. So from kids to dogs, bring Fido to Barn and Brunch. Yes, Bark and Brunch. Lost and Found Restaurant is hosting the event along with the Houston Humane Society. I actually have a preview and a doggone cute pup up for adoption. As most of you know, it is so important to adopt, don't shop. So local restaurant Lost and Found is hosting, I'm so excited about this, a Bark and Brunch this weekend <laughs> to help bring awareness to dog adoption. So here with us to share more is Brittany, Angelina, and of course the real star of the show, Baby. Sit. Ladies, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for having us. Yes, thank you. So first things first, Brittany, tell us what the event is. Um, so basically it's a Bark and Brunch and our goal is to bring a awareness to pet adoptions. Um, people come out with their dogs and they enjoy a brunch that we have for both dogs and people as well as we have on-site adoptions where p cute dogs like Baby <laughs> will be there. I love this. So you're with the Houston Humane Society. Thank you for the work that you do. Tell us about Baby and other dogs that are looking for their forever home. Yeah, so first of all, big thank you to Lost and Found who hosts these amazing events that help us find homes for our animals. Baby is a two-year-old cattle dog mix. She knows sit, she loves treats, so she's showing you her sit and treats. Um, she's a great car rider and she's just really uh, ready to find a loving home. So hopefully she finds a home at Lost and Found event this weekend. We're really excited. And I know that a lot of people are looking to adopt, especially because people are working from home now during yeah. the pandemic. Mm -hmm. So why is it so important for you all to host these events? Um, we just want to bring awareness to the community. So um, a lot of people don't know exactly how to find dogs or they, they don't realize how many dogs are out on the streets. So we want to bring awareness and you know, show them what's available. And you guys have a lot available during the event. Tell yes. us about some of the specials and the festivities. Um, so we do have vendors that come out. So for dogs and people, there's a lot of good goodies. And then um, we do have a dog menu as well as a human Ooh. menu. So dogs can enjoy our brunch as well as people. I love that. I need to bring my dog, Daisy May, oh, because please. she's bougie, and I think <laughs> she would definitely like brunch for sure. Now, with the Houston Humane Society, let's say we love baby, and we think that we're the perfect owners. What is the process, and do we have to pay? You know, are the dogs already spayed, neutered? How does yeah. that work? Yeah, so baby, if you're interested in her, she'll be at the event. You can take her home the same day. <gasps> She's telling me to tell you that <laughs> she wants people to go and adopt her the same day. But what comes with the dogs is they're already groomed, they're vaccinated, they're fully up to date, uh, nail trim, microchip, you name it. So we have some great staff on there that can let people know what else you get. But we're really just looking for someone to take the animals from there to their homes. Well, I think it's great. You get brunch and you could even take home a dog that yeah. needs a forever home. So where can people go to get more information? Um, if you want to get more information, you can go on our Instagram, which is Lost and Found Midtown. And it will come, it will have our up-to-date um, monthly posts about when we have our bark and brunches. I love it. And more on the Houston Humane Society. Where can people go? Uh, HoustonHumane.org, oh, uh, Facebook at Houston Humane, and Instagram. We'll be tagging Baby Yay. on the Lost and Found page, so more to come there. All right, come here, Baby. No one puts Baby in a corner, right? <laughs> oh, look yes. at this face. I mean, she needs a forever home. Thank you, yes. ladies, so much. I Thanks appreciate for having you. Us. Thank you. Good job, Baby. Oh. You're the real star. <laughs>
It's time to get together. He said he'll spit on me. See why we have you behind a shield? <laughs> Judge Mathis. Next on CW39. Houston. There's no sort of self-awareness going on in the media. I'm going to have a guest on. We can have a civil conversation. They can say, I don't agree with him, but I appreciate that he told me. And I think that's going to help. Hurry up to Gallery Furniture. I'm Mattress Mac, the king of furniture financing. Gallery Furniture work hard to get you financed today. We've got no interest financing with your good credit. 24 months, 36, 48, 60 months, depending on how much you buy, how much you put down, and best of all, get that no interest financing today. Gallery Furniture delivers your furniture free, free, free to your Houston area home in three or four hours a day. No interest financing available with your good credit. Free, free, free delivery today. Free haul for your old furniture. Free delivery, Gallery saves money today. Hi folks, Joe Namath here with a new message about your Medicare benefits. You may be entitled to transportation, meals, and expanded coverage for dental work that includes extractions, fillings, and dentures, all at no additional cost. Plus, depending on your zip code, you may be entitled to the Medicare benefit that adds money to your Social Security check every single month. Call and get everything you deserve. Call now. It's free. I'm on a fixed income, so I called to get money added to my Social Security check. They helped me so much. I called to save money on co-pays, get prescriptions, transportation, and my dental work covered. I couldn't believe I was spending money I don't have to spend. Millions of people have trusted the Medicare coverage helpline, and you can too. Call now. It's free. Call 1-800-615-8566. That's 1-800-615-8566 now. Adam Miller, the Texas Bulldog. I was involved in a rear-end accident. Working with Adam, my experience was great from start to finish. Are you tired of fighting the insurance companies? Call Adam Miller, the Texas Bulldog, now. He will work like a dog to get you every penny you have coming for your injuries and damages. He doesn't get paid unless he wins your case. Call 713-572-3333. He's ready to fight. Because we don't just bark, we bite. Team CW39 is going for comedy gold. I love you so much, I will never let you go. Strong as an ox. Dumb as one, too. It's that, huh? <laughs> Weekday, starting at 4 on CW39. Houston. Well, good morning and good Wednesday. The common theme continues this week with heat and pops of those isolated showers. We'll see our forecasted highs at 95 degrees there, but you factor in that humidity and it's going to feel a lot like between that 103 to 105 mark. We'll see a few of those PM pops of energy and again, that'll be the theme here through our week. You'll notice that we are continued to see those upper 90s to get us through our afternoons, some upper 70s as we're walking out the doors in the morning and yes, those isolated changes chances for some showers making their way into our forecast. We get towards the weekend and we bump up in our temperatures. We're talking 97, so definitely want to stay hydrated and stay out of that heat as much as possible if we can. Next week rolls around Maggie and we are back in store for another one of those summer frontals moving in, but the heat's not really going anywhere at all. <laughs> ah, so you know what that means. Yeah. Cranking up that AC. Mm -hmm. I know I walk to my car and then I just like put my face in the AC, but also at home. And we want to make sure you're not overpaying for your electricity. Friends don't let friends overpay, right? So this next segment has more and it's brought to you by Power Wizard. When it comes to saving money on electricity bills, I have two words for you. Power Wizard. Joining us is friend of the show, Jeff. He's the Director of Operations. And I have to say, Jeff, you truly work magic. We do our best for customers every day to try to just make wonderful things happen for them. And here's the thing. A lot of times we fall for these gimmicks and we don't know we're being taken advantage of. Tell us about this. Yeah, there's all kinds of gimmicky rates out yeah. there that the uh, utility companies are playing games. And a lot of them are these free nights. You hear, you know, solar days, but it's it's where you get free electricity. And who doesn't want free electricity? Yeah, sounds great. Uh, the challenge is, is there is no such thing as a free lunch. <laughs> uh, and, uh, you know, th that's true with that savings. Look at how much you're paying for electricity during your times you're paying for it and it's like in the 20 cents 23 cents and so we tell people there's one line on your bill you have to find and, and it can be hard to find it 
it's purposely hidden on most bills, and it says your average price per kilowatt right. is. And think about it, the electricity companies don't want you to know how much you're paying, but it has to be on your bill from a regulatory perspective. And if you see that line on your bill and it's more than 10 cents, uh -huh. then you're paying too much money in the market, plain and simple, and you need to do something quickly. And that's when we go to you. You find us the perfect provider that's good fit for us, right? We do everything for you. Yeah, in, it's fact, awesome. in fact, it's more than just finding it. And so what we always tell people is when you got that bill in your hand, come to powerwizard.com. We have this great tool that you can find out how much you're pay overpaying. Yeah, that's just one month. We actually want to look at how much you're overpaying over the entire year. And so that's what we're finding out is people are like, well, I'm overpaying this month. And we say, but actually on an annual basis with our savings calculator, it'll show you that you're overpaying $1,000 a year. $1,500 a year. In fact, a lot of people, what we're seeing is they're cutting their bill in half. Jeez. And so it's real easy. Just come to our calculator at powerwizard.com and you can fill that out. And it's amazing how much money we can save you. And here's the thing. You just told me this story about this elderly mm. couple and you really are their knight in shining armor. Tell us about this. Well, you know, here's an example. An elderly couple, uh, you know, uh, called us and basically said, I've got my bill. I'm not used to working with computer. Can you help us? And so we worked with them and started looking at their bill and they were paying 17 and a half cents a kilowatt. They were on one of these free night plans. So their electricity was free from like 8 p.m. at night till 8 in the morning. And so they were doing everything at night. They're oh washing their laundry, dishwashers, uh, to try to get the, the free stuff. And their average price was still 17 cents. We were able to move them to a rate that was like eight and a half cents and because of that we cut their electric bill in half. And so here's a couple, she was 79, he was 82, they were uh, you know social security, fixed income, and we cut their electric bill in half. And we hear stories on a regular basis where we do this for customers. And you know it sounds too good to be true. There's no way you, somebody can cut your electric bill in half, but we do that for customers all the time. And just think, that could be your grandparents, your yes. loved ones, and the fact they were doing everything at night. I mean, it's heartbreaking. Mm, yeah. And there's a lot of us, I mean, myself included, we can be gullible and they prey on the week, but you're here to save the day. We're here just to take care of you. The electricity market is confusing, and so we, pick, we work with you to figure out what the best plan for you is. We sign you up. We keep track of that plan throughout the year. We take care of your renewals. I mean, we literally do everything for you. And I tell people, we do all the work for the electricity market because it's confusing. You just sit back and enjoy the savings. And like I said, for the average consumer, it's 400 to 1,000 or even more every year that we save you. And it's just a small fee. We charge you $8 a month. $8. So less than a cup of coffee at your favorite coffee place. Uh, and uh, th that's it. And if you think about it, if you're saving over $100 a month, and we're charging you $8, I think that's, I think that works for you. I think that's doable. <laughs> so you know what's doable? Logging on over to Power Wizard right now. Give them the website. Powerwizard.com. Come down, give us a call if you want, and we're here to take care of you. Allow him to work his magic. Thank you as always, my friend. Thank you. And speaking of power, we have the power to make sure we take care of our health. I actually spoke with Dr. Yvette Poindexter about the importance of women's health in this segment brought to you by Community Health Network. During the pandemic, many women neglected to have a well woman's exam. Now's the time to take care of ourselves, ladies, and Community Health Network is here. Joining me is Dr. Yvette Poindexter. Thanks so much for waking up with us. Thank you, Maggie. You and I were talking off air about how important it is for women to get these exams. Tell us more. And during the pandemic, a lot of us fail to do that somewhat. So right now, a well woman is about prevention. And it doesn't mean just pap smear anymore. Also, it's about taking care of your comprehensive self. So spiritually, emotionally, and physically. And that's what I love about you all. You offer all of those services in one place. Can you just imagine that? We call it integrated care. Mm -hmm. Integrated care is very important for a woman or for anyone. So we can offer all the services from Community Health Network, which include medical, dental, behavioral health. We even have pharmacy services. We have services that will help you navigate through your care. Yes, and the staff there, they help you. And I know sometimes we get nervous going to the doctor, especially if we haven't been in a little while. But don't be nervous, especially ladies. I know we put everybody else first. But another service that I think is really important is for all of the women who may be expecting and pregnant. 
Well, I am an obstetrician gynecologist. I have been practicing for 23 years. Jeez. Yes. Congratulations. And, well, thank you. I appreciate that. We offer prenatal care. And prenatal care is very important, especially as we experience through the pandemic, we've gone through equity for, other, for all as well. And so it's very important that we as women, when we are pregnant, we get in during our first trimester. Mm -hmm. We can prevent such morbidity and mortality, such as preterm labor and other events that may occur later on in pregnancy. And I know a lot of women, they worry too, maybe they were laid off and they got pregnant you know during the pandemic a lot changed for a lot of people and they don't have insurance but never fear you no, guys are here that is no problem for community health network community health network we are a community-based organization that is again here to help you as a person to do comprehensive care so we can look at what your needs are. Social determinants of needs of health are very important and may determine whether or not you receive your prenatal care. So we can help you look at the different services that we offer, like my prenatal care. Uh, there are programs as well that we offer that if you don't have that eligibility insurance right at that time, we can go ahead and get you started because the most important thing to do, Maggie, is to get your prenatal care during that first trimester. All right, ladies, you heard it from the doctor. Where can people go to get more information? Well, look at this right behind me, mychn.org or call 281-824-1480. You are a delight. Thank you so much for joining us and I appreciate all that you're doing for women and for the community. Thank you, Maggie. And in other health news, the As One Foundation and One Delta Plaza Educational Center will be hosting a blood drive in honor of International Sickle Cell Caregivers Day this weekend. On average, a sickle cell patient receives blood transfusions once or twice a month to manage their condition and prevent complications. Well, due to the pandemic, local blood banks were forced to cancel blood drives, which resulted in a nationwide shortage. So that's why they need your help to donate tomorrow from 1 to 6 p.m. at One Delta Plaza Educational Center. So important. We are Houston Strong. So for more information and to donate, go over to our website, CW39.com. In the meantime, stick around. We have plenty of Houston Happens headed your way. Play Powerball, Mega Millions, and more right on your phone. Meet Jackpocket. Over 200,000 lottery winners and counting. Like Brandon, he won a million bucks. Nice job, Brandon. And Allie and Chris, they won big too. With over $18 million in prizes won so far, there's only one question. Are you next? This is a paid advertisement for legal services. Us bikers have a code to look out for each other on the road and off. So if you're ever in a motorcycle crash, let me do you a solid. Call the law firm that knows motorcycle cases. Call Terry Bryant. They're the real deal. And they have years of experience fighting for injured bikers. Listen, take it from Paul Sr. After a crash, these guys have your back. You deserve justice. You deserve Terry Bryant. Call 713-973-8888. I noticed on my leg that I was getting some blue veins. My life was interrupted by constant itching. I didn't know what was wrong with my legs. I couldn't wear the shoes that I wanted to wear. For over 35 years, Vein Clinics of America has been the leader in the treatment of vein disease. Varicose veins and spider veins are much more than an unsightly cosmetic problem. Often it's a serious medical condition. Call or go online now to see if you qualify to book a free, no obligation consult. Vein Clinics of America gave my life back. I'm glad I went to Vein Clinics of America, and Vein Clinics of America works. I feel really confident in what I wear and feel cute every day. Thank you for giving me my legs back. Call today, see if you qualify for a free consult or teleconsult. Many procedures are covered by Medicare and most health insurance. Vein Clinics of America, healthy looks good. Call 1-800-315-7813.
That's 1-800-315-7813. When moving, you choose the home that fits your life. And with Pick Your Free from Reliant, you choose the free electricity plan that fits your life. Truly free weekends. Truly free nights. Or truly free flex days. Whichever you pick, we'll upgrade your plan to solar on us. Call 1-866-RELIANT to pick your free. Reliant. That's power your way. Do you want everything you may deserve? Tell the insurance company you mean business. This is my jam. Well, welcome back, everyone. We are winding down on yeah. the show. I can't believe it. I know. It went by so fast. Before we go, I'm going to try to get something out of you. You mentioned your mom's dress. Are you going to give me more details? No. <laughs> I'm big I on this. It. Everyone wants to know what my <laughs> dress looks like. No. And then my mom, I will tell you it is sapphire blue because my Nana wore that okay. on her wedding. Okay. And you know I'm very sentimental in the Marguerite you tradition. Are. So I had to try it. It is, yeah, you just have to come to the wedding. I'll be there. Yes, front row. <laughs> Hold up a sign. No, I'm yes. just kidding. <laughs> It'll be here, you guys, before we know it. it but is. in the meantime, unfortunately, the end of the show is here before we know it. And today's show's sponsored content was brought to you by Power Wizard and Community Health Network. Of course, we'll see you back here, same place, same time, for more Houston Happens. Have a great day, everyone. Bye for now. I'm sure you're doing